Well, you can't really see my face, but you can see behind me. This is a great intro into today's vlog. This is supposed to be my first race this weekend, and uh, this kind of explains what's going on here. Absolute downpour and a thunderstorm here at Factory SBR. Well, what an intro that was. A video that is long overdue to you guys. It's funny, let me explain myself here a little bit. I put out the video, we fired the car and whatnot. Uh, we dropped the car off to Eric Gannon. That following day I got sick with some sort of cold or whatever, it lasted about a couple days, about a week or so. Then right into that is the busiest time of the year for me and my family is rodeo week. So we put on a pro rodeo um, in Reading. My dad's the president of the association, I am a member and uh, it's a great time all the time. So that that's what I was busy with. Meanwhile, the car was at Eric Gannon's shop, and let me tell you, Eric Gannon is a master at his craft. I mean, I could not do this without Eric and Todd, especially. Todd had the motor dialed in as well, but Eric, his NASCAR abilities on the way he dials stuff in, absolutely unreal. Let me show you guys what he did. So the car is getting just about wrapped up and ready to go. Check that out, brand new motor mounts, locked in really well there. He got that dialed in for us. Come around on this side, new, well, same motor mount there, but a new motor mount there. Then check this out, my favorite part, boom, new steering column holder right there. Super nice, way safer than what I had. And then if you come back here, a new battery to power this bad boy. So this is a short video kind of explaining what's going on. Now my original goal was to run with SCCT this weekend up in Medford, Oregon at White City. Tanner was going to run his sprint car. I was going to run this Saturday night as a supporting class. Now. Once again, it's kind of funny, my first race that I planned for, boom, mother nature strikes, it rains out. Oh well, is what it is. Anyways, I made the call, we're gonna head down south to Antioch Speedway. I don't know how the car count's gonna be down there, I've seen Antioch a few times. Definitely gonna keep watching some videos to kinda get myself an idea of how to run the track or whatnot, but this will be truly the first race, I guess, um, if she holds together, which fingers crossed, I think we've got a great program here going, and I think she will, but you know, as you all know, my very first race, we blew up in qualifying, so hopefully we can make it into a heat race this time, and I think we will. We did some road testing. I'll put some clips of that in right now. Now road testing went very well, it's funny. Right when I rolled out of the trailer, fired it up, and was ready to make a pull down the road, started pouring, we put it back in the trailer, so it's just kind of funny. We've been fighting weather, and you know, if you follow Tanner's channel, he's definitely been fighting weather as well with the sprint car series and whatnot, but same here, Factory SVR is no exception, we are fighting weather big time. Let me show you something else cool that's going on inside the trailer. So we're having big improvements made. We have E-Track to tie the car down. I don't know if I ever mentioned this, but I built a 125cc pit bike. Uh, it's perfect for the pits. I've never had one, so I was like, you know what, that'll be perfect. I want that, built it, definitely a Chinese special there. Organized all my you know lubricants and everything that I need on the car, waters and all that good stuff. Fuel tank rack, two five gallon jugs of fuel, which is perfect, full of SST oil race fuel that I got from the 76 pump here in Reading. And it's kind of dark in here. I don't have the power hooked up, but anyway, some other organized stuff, toolbox, all that good stuff you've already seen. 
Now I wanna go more in depth on everything in which I will do in a later video when the trailer's all wrapped up, but right now I'm kinda making a mad dash to get everything ready. It is Thursday night, it's getting kinda late. The sun's about to set here officially, and then I work Friday morning, and I was gonna go to Tanner's on Friday morning actually, but you know, we're not going there anymore. So uh, gonna be working on the car a little bit more tomorrow. And then once it's all said and done, the car's loaded, uh, everything's finalized. I'm gonna make another video of then talking about what I'm expecting at Antioch um, and other good stuff like that. And I'm super proud to present to you some new partners that are on board with me this year. If you follow my Facebook, you've probably already seen that post, but I've got some great sponsors on board that I'll talk about in that video. Like I said, this is gonna be kind of a short update video. I showed you a brief overview of what we got going on on the car from the fab shop. We got some new stickers coming. I, I can't wait to share that with you guys a little bit later, but that won't be in the next video because I can't let that go too soon. But anyways, thank you guys for watching. Quick little update. We're headed south to Antioch this weekend. I'm super excited. Next video will drop on Saturday, so you'll see this video tomorrow on Friday. The following video will be Saturday, talking about everything that's all said and done. And then Saturday, race day, the vlog will come out probably Monday-ish or Sunday, somewhere in there. But anyways, super pumped to finally get behind the wheel in 2022. Can't thank all my sponsors enough and Eric Gannon and Todd Thompson. They have really just helped out this program this year. They've put in so much time already and I can't wait to represent them and hopefully come out with a few checkered flags this year. Anyways, my name is Ben Gooch. Thank you all for watching.